Hi gorgeous ghoulies. I hope y'all are doing well today and you're ready to see what I got in my latest haul, which is from Hot Topic. It's not huge and it's kind of summery. So if you want to see what I got, stick around. Hi everyone, hope y'all are doing well. Like I said in the intro, I'm repeating myself like I always do and You'll have to forgive the lighting. It's really like cloudy outside and overcast. So I'm using the lights and you know how that does with my glasses, but it is what it is. So I can't see without them and contacts just don't work for me anymore. Now I'm older and wear bifocals. And this is totally off topic. Speaking of topics, this is hot topic is what this haul we're doing now. I've got two shirts uh kimono cover-up kind of thingy um shawl whatever and shorts that i love and three pieces of jewelry so yeah let's get into it first thing we have here is let's see here yes i am looking away again this top is called moonchild chain wash girls tank it's a size two if you know how hot topic and Corridor. It's a size two, so I don't remember what that's equivalent to, but yeah. So that's this one, and actually it fits perfect, Moonchild. Let me lower this just a little bit because you want to see the length of it right here. Usually prefer my tops to be a little longer, but this actually I don't mind because when you see the shorts, they have the coolest crescent zip pull thingy. So, yeah, I'll get into those in just a second. Yeah, just plain, basic, moon child. This makes it not so basic with the chain. Yes, I spit. Again, I am done. I'm done. These teeth are killing me. So, anyway, yeah. This is what makes it a little bit more, you know, a little different, a little oomph to it, you know, kind of thing. And it's kind of got a wash to it. I don't, see, like that. It's kind of marbly, you know, but it's some kind of wash. And the back is just plain. Now, let's get into these short pockets and front pockets. And a chain. All comes with it. And these are called Black Moon Zipper Ultra High Rise Shorts with Detachable Chain Plus Size. And these are in a 16. I'm a 14, 16, depending on the place. And when they're more like junior type sizes, you have to go to 16, so this is what this is. They are super stretchy, you know? Yeah, see that? Now, this here zipper doesn't have anything that really holds it up, but they have been so kind as to put a little button right there so it keeps your pants together, so it keeps this up. Detachable chain, black, stretchy, so they're com these are so comfortable. This outfit is so cute. I mean, I, I can't. This entire haul, which isn't very big, I love everything in it. And I was like, this gotta be the first one I filmed because I don't want to wear these pieces and I don't like to wear them until after I've showed you guys. So on that note, getting done with this, before I try on the other um, clothing, it's just another shirt and a cover up which you actually saw the cover up in the intro, but I just want to go through this because I had them here, sitting here. Yes, my table's there. I hope it isn't too inconvenient for everybody that you can see it. These are, let's see. Oh, by the way, the shorts are $29.90 and the Moonchild shirt is $26.90. Now, I don't know, I think I had a discount. And I don't know if that's including, it might be including the discount, those prices. Not positive, but I, yeah, I think it was probably $29 for the tank. So what's that, like a 20% discount? A couple bucks. So anyway, here we have steel, silver, opal, gem. Um, nope, that's not the right one. Black heart safety pin earrings. Nope, that's not it either. Whoa, maybe I need to stop today and rethink everything because I'm not focused. In case you can't tell, my... Brain is doing the manic thing. Steel Celestial Crystal Captive Hoop. All right, these were $15.90. And 
Let me take them out of here. They're still on the plastic. I don't know, maybe you can see, can you see better that way? I don't think so. Let's take them off and then put my hand behind them. They are really, really cute. Let me take them off of here. They're captive and I have not tried, I've tried, checked out the others already, but I haven't checked this out. So I don't know how hard it's gonna be to you to wear them, but they are adorable. Here's one of them. This little crescent and then a little gem. And the other one has, is it a sun? Yeah, <laughs> the little like synthetic opal kind of glass thing in there and then the little bead there. So yeah, these are, did I say what gauge they are? These are a 14. 14 gauge, which my new piercings are 16, but it's nothing to stretch from there to there because I wanted to wear those in those spots there in the new hole that I have. So there's that one. Now, since I've already described every or told you what everything else was before I even showed it, let's get on to the rest of it now that you already know. Okay, this is septum, silver, opal. It says silver, but the opals in it are pink. And this is a 14 gauge, which will go for my nose. But it might be big because my space between here and here is close, small. Let me put this camera back up there so I can talk a little bit better. I'm right in the camera here. But see, it's got like a pink tint to the opal color. Uh, they're synthetic. I mean, I'm pretty 100% sure they kind of look just like pearls with a little pearlescent stuff on it. But yeah, it's a 14 gauge clicker, easy to easy peasy. And this one has been bothering me lately. So I'm going to try this one and hopefully it isn't too long, but I have a feeling it's going to be, yeah, it's going to hang down on my lips, which then proceeds to smear my lipstick or whatever. Tripping over my rug here. And I am manic. I probably shouldn't even be recording today being this manic. And these are safety pin earrings. Black Heart is the brand. Am I correct? Safety pin earrings. It said back order on there, but I've got them. So I don't know. That's really weird. Unless if I wanted to buy them again. Because then it says expect to do ship by and then it says null. So I'm not quite sure what that's about. Weird. They never told me anything like that. And they're just a basic safety pin, but actually has, let me see, let me take them off here. It doesn't have the little loopy thing you have on a normal one, and it doesn't have a point, a sharp point, which once again, those will be worn up in that spot. And that's really all there is to it. Let me see if I can get it. There you go. That's all they are. Was that about inch, inch and a quarter? Not very huge. Let's see if I can get it. You know, I have to get that in there at least once. So, that's the jewelry. I only have two more items. And look at this. Look at this manic brain. Okay, we're at eight minutes right now, according to my recording. I bet I can still make it a 30 minute build, bleh, video. <laughs> All right, y'all. If y'all want to see what else I got, which is only a couple of things. Stick around. All right, y'all. This is, these are the last two pieces. And this is, let me tell you, and tell you the price and all that good stuff. I didn't even tell you the price on the other stuff. The other jewelry, the safety pin ones were $4.90. And the septum clicker was $9.90. Now, Moon and Star Burnout Velvet Kimono in a size 2 slash 3. It was $39.90. It was a little more expensive, yes. But it is worth it. I, it is gorgeous. I don't know if you can see the burnout in it. Let's see here. See? Oh, there you go. See the little moons, stars. It's gorgeous. And let me tip this back just slightly because I don't know how low it's going to go over here. If I can get it all in there. It is only this long, which is nice. I have so many really long ones that... I just like the length. It has fringes on it. What I do like is that they are not connected on the bottom. I hate that whenever you get something and they're connected loops. It's like, uh, did y'all forget to do something there? 
but yeah, it's adorable. Basic velvet burnout. Gorgeous. I love it. It is super comfortable and y'all know I will burn up this summer, but as soon as fall gets here and it's like chilly at night, this will be perfect. So there's that. And here is the top, which is called Floral Occult Symbol Crisscross Panel High Low Girls Tank Top Plus Size in a size 2. And it was $26.90. Here it is. It's got these little panels here. There, it's like a crisscross panel there. It goes across. Tip it down just for a second so you can see. And it is not like the The other shirt was a cotton knit. Felt like this is a rayon feeling. I don't know if there's any. No, I don't think there's any stretch in it. Let me tip it down a little bit because the back also has a detail down the back of the crisscross. This one is longer than the other one. I think the other one might have been short because it matches with the moon shorts and it shows. But yeah, that's the other one. And... That's the end of this haul. I can't believe how quickly I did that. Miracles happen. As I usually say, I'm a little boy. Yes, Pinocchio. I don't know. I don't know why I do that. It's one of those things I do. So yeah, it's just, you know, basic. Basic little tank tops for summer. And actually it does feel like there is the slightest bit of stretch. So, But I wouldn't count on it fitting, like going up another size from what this is. It's not going to fit a bigger size. Does that make sense? Anyway, um, there's the arms. Uh, if anybody's interested in the necklace, my spider neck spooters, it's coming up in an AliExpress jewelry haul. No, I have another one with quite a few pieces in it. So if you want to see that one, I will get it filmed probably in this next week or so. But yeah, that's the end of this one, this video here. I have quite a few more to do, so I'll probably have the same look for a couple of videos is what it is. I want to get them done early. So I have the month of May planned out already. I'm trying to do these things. I have so many boxes to unpack. And if I keep rambling, I will have a 30 minute video. So thank you for watching this far if you have. I hope everybody's doing well. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do so. It means the world to me, it really does. It helps me with trying to reach certain goals I'm setting for myself. It's not the end of the world if I don't make them. It's not like I'm going to beat myself up or anything, but it would be nice. So if you watch regularly, and even if you don't, but if you like the content, please subscribe and leave me a thumbs up if you like it. I don't want to hear about the thumbs down because that's just mean and there's no reason for it, especially if you're not going to tell me why. And if you tell me why and you're hateful, I'm going to call you out to everybody on Instagram and Facebook because I'm just that bitch. Yep, that's who I am. Sorry, not sorry. So anyway, just remember y'all, y'all are beautiful just the way you are and don't let anyone take away your shine. Talk to y'all next time. Bye.